Hello creative people, welcome back to a brand new Photoshop CC tutorial by Amish Rabbi. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to animate still photographs like a plotter graph in Adobe Photoshop CC 2017. So let's do it. Please subscribe my channel to support me. Also visit my professional website www mhravi.me where I give all the projects files for free. Thank you. Go to image, and image size. And reduce the image size so that our computer GPU does not become slow. Use a normal HD size. Click on the quick mask icon and pick a small brush and then draw over the area you want to animate. Draw black where you want to add selection and use white to deselect. Now press Q, for quick selection. Go to select, and invert selection. Press Ctrl plus J to make a new layer with the selection area. Press the quick mask icon again and brush over an area to animate. for quick selection. Go to select, and invert selection. Press Ctrl plus J to make a new layer with the selection area. Go to window, and timeline. To turn on the animation timeline. Convert the layers into a smart object. Resize it into one second or you can use at your choice. Click on the timer icon and create a keyframe. Create another keyframe and press Ctrl plus T to transform the image. Now place the last keyframe to the end of the clip. Use fade 
to make your animation more cinematic. Now do the same steps again to this video. Use fade, to make your animation more cinematic. Now you will see that your image is animating like a photograph. Group all layers and press Ctrl plus J to copy the group. Use the shortcut key as many copy as you need. Now position your groups to get an awesome animation. Give more time to positioning the groups. It will help you to improve your animation. After creating your animation, click on this icon to export your animation as a video format. Use a position, name, and edit the format and size to get it as your choice. When everything is perfect, click on the render button to export the animation as mp4. After animating the photo, you will see that your photo is moving as same as the natural moving video.